What's up guys, today's video is on the top 5 best CPU coolers in 2021. Through extensive research and testing, I've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price, performance, or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. If you want to save a bit of money and still get a quality product, we have specially singled out the Cooler Master Hyper 212 Black Edition, also known as the best budget CPU cooler available on the market in 2021. This model looks amazing with that elegant black finish and has cooling capabilities to boot. It is difficult to find a cooler in this price class that can compete with the new CM cooler in the key features. We can freely say that the Hyper 212 has been among the most popular models of this type for years and has secured an almost legendary status among Air CPU coolers. The recognizable appearance of the silver body combined with the copper brown pipes is bound to grab anyone's attention. Numerous ribs with precisely adjusted spacing form a large heat transfer surface. Their position is carefully adjusted to be as aerodynamic as possible and to minimize the resistance to airflow from the fan. The cooler uses a system of four U-shaped heat pipes, which at their lowest point directly rest on the heat dispenser of the processor. This allows the device to achieve the most efficient contact and thus heat transfer. In the part of the contact with the processor, the heat pipes are flattened to maximize the useful heat transfer surface. One CM Silencio FP120 fan is mounted on the Hyper 212 Black Edition. It uses a silent drive IC motor that reduces operating noise and power consumption. The operating mode of the fan extends from a minimum of 650 RPM when it is practically silent to a maximum of 2000 RPM. Fan operation is controlled by a PWM system that you adjust from the motherboard by BIOS. According to the manufacturer's data, the fan emits 26 decibels of noise in the maximum drive and is capable of drawing 1.2 cubic meters of air per minute, creating a maximum static pressure of 28.4 pascals. The range between the lowest and highest measured operating temperature is also above average for this class, which is proof that the cooler is well designed and well balanced in terms of operating characteristics. When you take the affordable price into account, you get a recommendation for ideal cooling in a middle class PC desktop computer. For the listed price, we are beyond impressed. The next product we'll discuss on a rundown for today is the Corsair Hydro Series H75, which quite rightly took the title of the best value CPU cooler in 2021, all thanks to its amazing ratio of performance, quality, and price. The Corsair Hydro Series H75 allows everyone to discover the benefits of water cooling while avoiding most of its disadvantages. Already filled and hermetically sealed, the system is ready to use and does not require the maintenance of standard water-cooled configurations. Compatible with the vast majority of current motherboards, the Corsair Hydro Series H75's liquid cooling system is compatible with most AMD and Intel sockets. Note that the discharge port and the pump consist of water description contents with a copper base. This base is equipped with microchannels that enable an increase in the area between copper and water and thus improve heat exchange. The top section is occupied by a pump unit that is compact as it is quiet. The cooling part is provided by a 120mm radiator with aluminum fins. It comes with two fans that rotate at a maximum of 2000 RPM and offer a flow rate of 54 CFM at a volume of 31.4 decibels each. These features are truly great in this price range. Also, flexible pipes that connect the two parts ensure the tightness of the hole. Two SP120L 120mm fans support PWM mother board fans, so the motherboard can automatically control fan speed based on processor temperature. The microfin copper cooling plate and the high-quality ceramic pump with bearings ensure reliable heat transfer from low noise away from the CPU. Like all Hydro Series liquid CPU coolers, the Hydro H75 series is fully integrated and requires no refilling or maintenance. Furthermore, it boasts a high-quality ceramic pump with bearings and a reliable pump mechanism that is specially designed for silence. Users also like the fairly simple and fast installation as well as efficient operation, which they point out as a special advantage. The Corsair Hydro Series H75 weighs 1.16 pounds while its size is 4.72 by 1.06 by 6.1 inches. For the listed price, you can't beat this guy. 
Up next, check out the Noctua NHP1, which has fetched the title of the best passive CPU cooler that can be found on the market in 2021. As the name suggests, this is the first passive cooler that has a Noctua brand, which we can mount on processors. With this passive model, we achieve the absence of noise from this component, although it must be said that we can also install a fan. On the back, we can see a description of the different features of this cooler. Passive operation without a fan, without noise, compatible with RAM, graphics, and future sockets, as well as a torque screwdriver and a six-year warranty. We open the box and find, first of all, a set with tools and mounting accessories. Inside is everything you need to assemble this cooler, and instructions and accessories for each outlet. The entire Noctua NHP1 block will be connected with six thick nickel-plated copper heat pipes starting directly from the cold plate. They lift the upper half of the block and go through all the fins to distribute the heat evenly. We now turn to the most important element, the cold plate, which is made of nickel-plated copper. The recording surface is intended to completely cover the IHS of common consumer intel in AMD CPUs. On both sides, we have the SecuFirm 2 Plus anchoring system, consisting of two torque screws and a classic spring for adjusting the pressure. In addition to the heat pipes, six rib extensions also start from the cold plate to improve this transfer. This is a PWM-controlled fan that runs between 450 and 1200 RPM, creating just 12 decibels, so it's virtually silent. The spiral propeller design made of glass polymer-based material and hydraulic bearing will give it a huge durability of 150,000 hours. At the design level, Nocto has done the usual flawless work. High-quality finishes, plenty of accessories, and a wonderful fan. This is a quality product, and all we can do is recommend it. Do you want your CPU cooler to run as quietly as possible? Then the next product we'll talk about is the perfect option for you. Introducing Be Quiet Dark Rock Pro 4, by far the best silent CPU cooler available on the market in 2021. This model supports a TDP of no less than 250 volts, so the cooler is high-end oriented and compatible with the vast majority of current sockets other than Threadripper because we already have a specific Dark Rock version for them. All the ends of the heat pipes are perfectly attached the cylinders of the same size and symmetrical location. The aesthetics are wonderful, sporting the brand name with chrome letters. Dark Rock Pro 4 consists of a dual tower configuration capable of scattering a TDP of up to 250 watts at a similar liquid cooling level of 240 millimeters. The size of the cooler is quite robust, with dimensions without a fan of 162.8 millimeters in height, 136 millimeters in width, and 119.5 millimeters in depth. It should be noted that since these are aluminum fins, we must be careful with the handling of the product because they bend relatively easily, and we have as many as 14 nickel-plated copper heat pipes coming out of the cold plate, one of the most complete configurations ever. These pipes are completely symmetrical on both sides and are welded to the ribbed blocks with a perfectly even distribution for optimal heat delivery over the entire surface. Another function of heat pipes is to increase the height of the blocks so that RAM modules can be placed under them. In total, a maximum noise of 24.3 dBA is generated, which is a truly low register in the part of the brand name, and the difference concerning the competition is indeed noticeable. However, these fans offer pretty good performance, with a speed controlled by PWM signal that can reach 1500 RPM on the small and 1400 RPM on the large. For this, they use a six-pole motor that minimizes vibrations and a hydraulic bearing that gives them a lifespan of 300,000 H, which is one of the most durable on the market. Thumbs up! Thanks to the great cooling capabilities with exceptional performance as well as excellent value for money, we have concluded that the Noctua NHD15 is the best overall CPU cooler that can be found on the market in 2021. An impressive package compared to others in this Noctua line, this model packs a set of six pipes and a 140mm double fan, among other things. Inside the package of accessories, we find a whole arsenal of anchors, an NTH1 thermal paste, and adapters for low noise. Already with the fan anchored from the the very beginning, we can see the large size of the cooler, which shines in its maximum shine with two cooler towers with six heat pipes that extend from end to end next to the block on the bottom of the cooler. The pipe coming out of the base of the cooler is quite well built. The base of the Noctua NHD15 has dimensions of 37mm by 39mm, which is enough to fully contact any processor within the permitted sockets. The rolling mechanism is SSO2, or self-stabilizing oil pressure covering the hydrodynamic bearing. The additional magnet is responsible for stabilizing the axis so that it has a much longer lifespan and creates less noise. In fact, it offers us an MTTF of 150,000H 
a figure that basically no other manufacturer reaches. Overall, this fella delivers premium performance and top-notch durability, all wrapped up in the best possible price-quality ratio. You wanted the best, you got it. Thanks for watching. That's all for now. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Till next time, see you guys later.